scheduled for 12. The tournament number one seed, Alexander Usyk, with the white trunks trimmed with gold and blue. In inexperience show up in favour of the... Both of them expressing similar sentiments in that they would think if you're going to score it, it's going to go towards you, Seb. Analyse some of the action from the first round. Nico Gassi went for a, a, for a big guy, 14 and a half time. Nice, nice combination there from Gassi. Gassi targeting the body with a good left hand. And remember, that's the shot that he used. Percentage for Usyk. Both guys can burn it up. That may affect the judge. He's just kind of prodding it in Gassi's face with a jab, with a right hook, with an up. Practically incessant, just continuing to poke it out and serve as a deterrent. And There's that two, three, four punch combination from Gassi, trying to slow Usyk, slow him down, work to the, very intelligent work to the body, another left hook to the body there. Partially blocked by Usyk. That's intelligent work from Gassi, he knows Usyk. Immediately out to the space of centre ring, but once Usyk, it is something that you have to mark from Gassiev, which may well slow down the movement of the WBC and WBO champion as this contest progresses. Start later on in the fight. Venue for the Olympic boxing tournament, but there were other terrific boxers. Patrice being staged in this venue. We see Gassiev not far behind. In nice counter left hook from Gassiev earlier, but if you are unnoticed. Body beneath Usyk's right elbow. Beautiful counter left hand. Nice jab there from Usyk, and there's that counter left foot, both handed then jab, and with the counter left foot. I think this fight's going to be a pick -em from round one to round 12, if it goes that far. Said that he possesses the mindset of anything that can be done to deter him. Beautiful left hand, and then a right uppercut, a reverse one-two, in flashy, effective fashion from Alexander Usyk. And Strong in the later rounds, I don't think he's going to mind losing the first. Goes on. Oh, Use that's a right, right hand. hand from Garcia, but he follows up with another thunderbolt that was wide of the mark. The best punch of the contest in terms of headshots landed by Gassiev. Here we go. Whack. Dangerous shot, there we are. Slip, bang. Cool, great shot. You took it well, to be fair. He held on for a moment, but he took it really well. Now that was in the closing seconds, that success from Gassiev. Bothered by that too much in the long term, but again, Marat Gassiev marauding his way forward. Encouraging, trying to encourage and rouse Gassiev. He took a hard single shot to the body, but came back with a combination of his own. A little bit of flair from the Ukraine here in round six, as it was in the opening round. But body shots sometimes. He was 17-0 with 11 knockouts as a combination. Gassiev, and then he digs one downstairs to the body, but look at the risk. At the summit up in Big Bear, demonstrates that the system works when they do it in training. Good left belief. Yeah, and there's nothing wrong, but um, he trains very hard. Well, I think he's getting points taken off, which we don't want to see in this fight. We don't want to see his right hand, the big power punch. Says we're going to be at our absolute best. We've left no stone. On best part, 15 and a half stone now, and the hand speed is... Identical, 198.2 pounds of the perpetual motion of Alexander Usyk, and there's a big right hand. There's a... He, oh, he, he fell short, he, he fell short one so far, I think, in my opinion. His corner team, beautiful. He's not getting in a... Getting involved in the punch-up with the... Try out there, all right? His little four-punch combination. Again, there, there weren't spiteful punches, but a little flick. Staying audibly, I would rather see you try, but this is a blistering start to the ninth stanza by Alexander Usyk. And Gassiev, well, he's not quite boxing in a blizzard, but it's pretty close to it when Usyk punches, puts his punches together like that. Impossible to discourage, it's a cracking... A lovely, lovely three-punch combination, four-punch, five. Seven, you cannot get here with eight punches without arms, and there's that lovely uppercut to finish. Knows. Usyk's accuracy, but then he comes back with a big right hand, which brings a round dominance of the tournament number one seed. Gassi still coming forward, looking for the finishing shot. But he's there to be hit. Good right hand to contend with. Gassi swinging and missing. I've been a bit disappointed with his, with his defense. Hasn't been much of a defense. He just, he just stood there. Like heavy bag, he hasn't slipped, he hasn't rolled. You mentioned the fact that Lomachenko is often referred to. He wants more. Usyk intimating that is to keep the punches up. But after going through that momentary discomfort, look at the few fighter with a perfect record tonight. Took the O of Christoph Glavatsky, Michael Hunter. But it's been a difficult mission for him. The two men just exchanging conversation there. Craft. 
it's the punch output. I mean, he's Fleet freely as Mercury deep into this 12th and final round. The 10 second clap are not audible. And Alexander Usyk gets on his bike as the bell sounds to conclude the 12th and final round. Nice to see that sporting embrace. A unanimous decision. He's still undefeated. And now the undisputed cruiserweight champion of.